What up everybody, it's me Mr. Riot here with the Martial Arts Brutality Performance Customization Tips and Health Review. Uh, I am the top player in the game uh, for right now as of this video, so uh, I feel I do have a lot of expertise in said, uh, you know, experience with giving help to people who need it. So, uh, but this is for any and all new people who are, you know, trying to get into the game. So, uh, as you progress through each martial arts discipline, you'll get points towards the next belt ranking uh, of, you know, that gives you performance points. And there are 18 uh, total points. And depending on your play style on your martial art is how you want to do it. So... Uh, there are four martial arts as of right now, Shaolin, Kung Fu, Shotokan, Karate, uh, Taekwondo, and Wing Chun. So with those, they have different uh, aspects, pros and cons, stuff like that. So Kung Fu is the default starter. Uh, it has a lot of well-balanced uh, features about it. It has no cons about it. So what I would recommend is uh, a bit of hand speed a bit of uh, hand power uh, about the same for as far as those are concerned uh, maybe one in each of these uh, strengths here uh, you don't necessarily need a lot of attack time uh, I would also learn your martial arts uh, adrenaline bonuses per round because in the before uh, a few patches ago um, you would get one adrenaline per round but now each uh, martial arts has a different uh, adrenaline so like for instance karate has 0.6 Wing Chun has 0.2 uh, Taekwondo has 0.7 and I think uh, Kung Fu has like 0.5 so uh, these would uh, you know by the time you are You know, by the time you're a dragon, uh, this is pretty much a well balanced uh, feature. Uh, it used to cost 18 freaking points to you know restart these, but thanks to the dev team, um, you know. So this is for kung fu, uh, for karate, uh, depending on how you want to do it. Um, I would definitely go something to this. Um, let's see, probably one in bones, uh, car cool down is fine, uh, counter, lean, starter chi, and attack time. Uh, this would be, now you don't have to do it like this, of course, but this is what I would do, uh, if I was starting out in these specific areas, um, now the next one I'm going to do is Taekwondo. Uh, Taekwondo, I would instantly put defense reflexes at the max because they have the weakest response time to the even the most minor of attacks. Of now, speed is the green circle. So if it's a uh, five or six, and you're not used to you know attack uh, getting you know the counters off. Uh, definitely get your reflexes up. Uh, after that. There's that, uh, bone strength, and probably, yeah, one in there. So this would be what I would do for a full-out aggro because Taekwondo's punches are very, very, very weak. Um, they're super slow, very, very underpowered. Um, I would not take them out of countering, but as far as offensive, feet is the way to go and full-out uh, speed and power. Uh, for Wing Chun is now my least favorite <laughs> simply because it's fast attacks however they lack power um, but in a swarming sense it could definitely uh, uh, overpower your opponent uh, definitely put up the bone strength there because Wing Chun's uh, bones will, are very brittle Definitely there, maybe one there, uh, and counter length. So hopefully this video helped you out. Uh, these are the bases of performance customization. Comment, like, subscribe.